what's up guys, it's me and Tiggy Gamer and welcome back to some more Super Mario Super Luigi 3D Land. <laughs> it's been a while since I've said the intro and the character's voice. But enough dawdling. Let's start. 4-3. Let's go. So just saying, happy summer solstice, guys. The yeah, as well say it. <laughs> happy summer solstice. The day is the longest day of the year, I guess. Sunwise. Supposed to. Oh, jeez. What a great start. But anyway, today's basically gonna be the longest day of the year, or something like that. And oh no, Luigi got his hat back. Dang, nabbit. Nabbit. Okay. But yeah, happy summer solstice, I guess. This is. The. Uh, I don't even know, oh, whoa, free Tanuki, I'll take it. I don't even know why I'm saying that, because this is not even going to go up on the day of summer solstice. So I take that back, but time to summer solstice anyway. But I hope you're having a good day. It's, it's the summer solstice, the day I'm recording this. But, yeah. <laughs> Yay, da 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 But anyway, yeah. I don't really have that much to talk about, actually. Um... Oh yeah, I actually, as the day of recording this, oh, yeah, I'll take the boomerang flower. I actually uh, just started playing New Super Luigi U, and oh my gosh, it's actually really hard. I'm actually kind of glad Luigi plays um, differently from that Luigi in this game. I mean, granted, oh, come on, he still uh, comes to a, he still slides around and such, but in that game, he's super slippery. Oh, whoops. Oh, God dang it. He's super slippery. <clears throat> and he has that little scuttle jump. Like from, let's see, what, what was another game he had a scuttle jump in? Kind of like in Super Mario 64 DS, he has a scuttle jump. But it, but it's kind of like Yoshi's flutter jump. Where it gives him vertical air rather than just hover time. Now, it does let him hover. But you go up a little bit and then you slowly fall fall down. So that's cool. Well, anyway, I'm really enjoying that. And I'm thinking of maybe doing a Let's Play of that in the future. Because I want to wait to do New Super Mario Bros. U for a while. And, oh, that was almost really bad. Because I just recently finished NSM. I just recently played NSMB 2 in New Super Mario Bros. Wii. So I kind of wanted to give the New Super Mario Brother games. Or, in general, 2D Mario platformers a break for a while. But I am wanting to do... Oh, yeah, by the way. Ultimate mega shortcut of all time. Uh, I don't think I'm going to make it, though. <gasps> Nailed it! Like a boss. Like a bossum G. I'm making up stuff on the fly now. It could be A for US. But I'm um, yeah. I just want to give it a break since I did two 2D Mario platformers. And the only reason I'm thinking of doing um, New Super Luigi use because Mario's not in it at all. And it, it's Luigi's own video game. Well, DLC really. But because Mario's not in it at all, that's the only reason why I would think of maybe doing it. What up, city? Oh no! No! God dang it! Oh man. Oh well. Oh, are you serious? I am Ultra Fail Sauce. Lol. Oh my gosh, that was bad. But, um, yeah, mainly because only Luigi's in it. And, you know, I might actually be able to get Matthew in that Let's Play as well. And Jacob. So it might be a three-player Let's Play. <gasps> Something completely new for me. No, I'm kidding. But, uh, hello, boo. Oh, man, I missed him. That's right, I don't have the Tanuki, so I actually have to be careful about how I run along these. Oh, come on. Yes. There we go. Oh, nay. Don't touch him now. Bam. Broke your skull, son. Now let's keep on trucking here. Like a boss. Oh no, it's a big boo! No, I'm kidding. But 
Yeah, big booze. He's here to visit us. Oh boy. Ha la la la. Sha la la la. Everybody is happy. Sha la. Okay. That was almost really bad. Alright, here we go. Finish line. <gasps> no. Oh. Dang it. I cannot believe I screwed that up. <laughs> oh man. Wow. That was ultra fail sauce right there. Holy cow. But um come on. We're almost at the end of the level. We can do these. I can do it. Alright. Wow. Just just wow guys. Too bad. Ah. <laughs> Oh boy. <sighs> Shut up, dry bones. Or I'll kill you, even though I can't kill you. I'll break your bones. So you can reassemble again later. And then I'll break him again. And then you'll have to reassemble again. Lol. Oh no. Come on. Let's keep our let's keep Luigi in motion. I don't know, jumping from a Trying to jump from a standstill is very weird. There we go. That's what I was trying to do the first time. <clears throat> like a boss. And I think we have time for the final airship of this world, so we'll be capping off this world in this video. So let you go. Yahoo! I also like how when Luigi's small, his voice is shrunk down too. Oh, this airship. Oh, no mushroom. Oh wait, no. Oh boy, this is actually kind of a gauntlet one. Right, come on. This actually should not be a problem since I'm small, Luigi. Since their attacks go right under me. I'm right over me. And look at this. You got nothing on me, son. I'm tiny. Oh, hey. Thanks for the boomerang, though. <clears throat> Excuse me. It will be cool, though, guys, if they brought back ha the hammer suit. That would actually be really boss. Because, I mean, I, I missed that from Mario 3. That was an awesome power-up. Ooh, I got a mushroom. Huh, I don't need to go that way. No, I'm kidding. But, um, yeah, they should bring that power up back. I loved using that thing. By the way, you can also just... Whoa! That was cool. You can also just duck under their attacks, too. I believe there's a fire flower over here, so I'm gonna go get that, too. Oh, man. So I'm gonna have to wait for him to come around for another pass. Come on! I'm pressed for time, dude. Yep, there's my fire flower. So I can switch between those. I also like how instead of a suit, it's a flower that makes you boomerang, that gives you the boomerang suit. Oh, this fight. This fight's special. Basically, it's like your normal fight with, oh jeez, it's like your normal fight with Boom Boom. That was an awesome flip out of danger there, though. But instead of having a oh jeez, oh jeez, okay, but instead of having a regular normal fight, there's spikes all over the floor. And they, and they pop up in two different sections at two different times. So it adds a little bit of danger to the fight. And I'm going to finish this guy off with fireballs. To humiliate him. <laughs> Oh boy, and I think we got Boom Pom Pom now, actually. Alright, let's go finish Pom Pom. Yep, we do have to fight Pom Pom. <coughs> bum, bum. <laughs> you don't have to. Oh, I almost thought I got to. Oh, jeez! <laughs> yeah, that's the other thing you have to worry about. The, uh, the donuts make this fight a lot more difficult. Just a piece of advice try not to run along the donuts like I just did. Oh, wow. I just butt pounded your boomerang. What you gonna do? What you gonna do with my shampoo? This is what I suggest to do. Just slowly walk along this, so you don't break any donuts. I also probably killed her in a really bad spot. If you're one for coins, because like most of them just flew off and are by edges. 
But anyway, enough blibber blabber about that. And hey, I think this is the first time we finish on an air sh Oh! Oh, wow. Wow. LOL! Yeah! Go, Ouija! Alright anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I think I'm going to try to stick to doing a world per episode. So next time, we'll, be, we'll either be doing half, or three, epi three, levels to an e three levels to an episode, I don't know. Because, yeah. But anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!